Hello friends, welcome back to my channel 15 Minutes Inspirations. Today we are going through a summary of bestseller book. Purpose, The Starting Point of Great Companies by Icos Mukherjee's. Icos Mukherjee's is a business consultant, lawyer and a writer born in Greece. He is a senior partner at an international consulting firm Pathia. He is also a member of the Stelios Philanthropic Foundation Board and Honorary Visiting Professor of Practice at Cass Business School. His book Purpose, The Starting Point of Great Companies, is being taught in universities across the globe and is considered as an important asset for all businesses. Let us see a brief about the book now. Purpose the starting point of great companies is all about the leadership and business strategy. The book describes why does your firm exist, beyond the absolute answer of money making. The clarity of your answer to the question will determine everything from your company culture to your staff's morale. The author discusses the four primary business purposes, discovery, helping, achievement and heroism in the book to inspire and get motivated beyond the bottom line. What is purpose? Purpose is probably the most important element of business success, it is difficult to understand or explain. Icos understood the purpose through a nightmare story of his family. The story begins as one day, the communists soliders came to our farm in Greece. They wanted my father who is opposing the communists, but my father was long gone to fight the communists. So communist soliders demanded the 54 women in our village that day to denounce my father, but they all refused to denounce. So the communists shot them all. Only two women survived, by hiding under the pile of bodies. Because of the tragedy that befell on my family. I have never been in danger of forgetting the centrality of purpose for any enterprise because, even though my family was destroyed that day, their deaths added to the horrific body count that ultimately toppled the communists. The women in my family died to help freedom prevail in their country. As a boy, I believed that my dead family members their names forever unknown, even in their own country were nonetheless immortal. I wanted to be their equal, to be somebody who changed the world for the better. To do that, I concluded, I would not only have to be somebody important, I would have to stand for something, I would need to find a purpose worth living for, and, if necessary, dying for. Icos believed that concrete stories are usually more powerful teachers than abstract ideas and his understanding of the purpose is I would need to find a purpose worth living for, and, if necessary, dying for. Purpose is crucial to a firm's success for three reasons. 1. Purpose is the primary source of achievement. 2. Purpose reveals the underlying dynamics of any human activity. 3. Purpose is all that successful leaders want to talk about although they do not usually use the word itself. What is not purpose? Profit, philanthropy, governance and long-term thinking, brand, firm principles, vision, mission and values, code of practice, or reputation. Icos describe that the purpose has four different forms. First is discovery, second is excellence, third is altruism, and the last is heroism. Discovery form is nothing but the action of finding the new concept or strategy in business as an adventure's challenge like putting men on moon. The examples of such form would be Tom Wistow of IBM, Elon Musk of Tesla, etc. Excellence form is being the best of anything done. This form talks about the virtues fulfillment like Warren Buffet Berkshire Hathaway. The third form altruism is all about provide service for the purpose of happiness which is empathy's justification. The form of purpose was followed Walt Disney of the Walt Disney Company and Sam Walton of Walmart. The last form of purpose is heroism which is being effective at whatever is done by demonstrating achievements. 
which is also known as Powers Effetives like Henry Ford of Ford Motors. How Purpose Builds Greatness All of the previous explayatios suggests that purpose is the starting point of greatness in companies. But what is a great company and how to build greatness? Through morale, innovation, competitive advantage and leadership. 1. Morale in the age of Trasperi, the employees knows much than the employers ever want them to know. The employers always hunt for talented employees to be part of the organization. Even when they are talented, with the less moral, they are a drain. The lack of morale can be due to various reasons such as nature of work, compensation, workplace, etc. The employers need to always work on increasing the morale in the company to achieve the greatness. The good moral are being supported by the four building blocks. First is rewards like stock options, incentives, etc. The second block is task like goals, deadlines, internal competition, etc. Third block is community, which is the employees being a member of the community in the organization will have a high morale and will go extra mile for the company. The example are events office parties, off-site and conferences, the fourth and last block is purpose. They are ready to action and will improve the morale even when the things are going well. Examples are internal and external communication of the purpose, unexpected victories, creation of top team, etc. 2. Innovation is any development which create change from a tiny process change to a big jet engine innovation. Example are Ford's purpose, use of machines to improve the world, and IBM's purpose, seek out the new, beyond our present conception. 3. Competitive advantage is to be able to generate more wealth than other companies in the same industry. This talks about routines and relationships. 4. Leadership is the ultimate advantage. ICOS talks about the four aspects of the leadership here. How the leaders need to think, inspire others, mobilize asset and empower their employees. In the last part, the author discusses where are we now and how to develop the purpose. Ultimately purpose in action. Below are the questions, leaders should ask themselves to find where are they now. Did customers are attracted to our product and service? Why employees come to work with us and not other company? Why investors put their money into our firm? When people criticize our firm? When we will reach our unfulfilled potential? Those who leads our firm has the skills. Best management system. When I leave my current role. Finally developing the purpose. Below are the step to identify and develop the purpose. Step 1. Review your strategy. Step 2. Draw out the implications. Step 3. Know thyself. Step 4. Understand company traditions. Step 5 Take a purpose inventory of the team. Step 6 Take a moral inventory of the community. Step 7 Identify purpose. Step 8 Create metrics and models. Step 9 Test strategy and purpose. Step 10 Decide. Key takeaway from the book. Purpose is not money, nor status. It is what people most want from work. Purpose is no guarantee of success, in itself. But it is a prerequisite at least for success in the long term. Thank you for watching the summary of Purpose The Starting Point of Great Companies by Icos Mukherjee's in 15 minutes inspirations. Please click the like button and subscribe to our channel. Learn and grow with us.